know everything about the internship provided to us by the government of India. Yes, in this video, I'm going to tell you what is the internship which is provided to us by government of India, who are all eligible for this, what is the complete guidelines, how many weeks or months they are offering, for what are the domains who are uh, really eligible for this, completely about the internship by government of India. So this is the link, this is a website that is Niti. Niti.gov.in is the website which is provided to us by the government of India. So here you can see this is the Niti Ayog uh, website and once if you click the internship, okay, so once if you click on um, uh, the Niti.government.in, um, you can see various options here, okay, so this is your complete options over here and if you wanted to find about uh, the internship, probably you have to go and uh, select here, okay. So you have various options available here. You can check and also if you want to know about the uh, internship, internship opportunity, then you can just go and select here. Okay, you can simply search here internship. Okay, so this is also possible or else you can just go and search for uh, the internship opp opportunities by, by the government. Okay. Uh, so you can find this internship opportunity here so once if you see in the left side you can see call for attendance current recru recruitment and internship okay this is what we wanted to see once if you click on the internship you can see this page so who are all eligible for this okay so one is undergraduate postgraduate students or research scholars enrolled in recognized university in India and abroad can apply for Niti Aayog internship scheme. So this is for students and UG students, PG and research scholars. Okay, so when you have you can apply for this. <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> this you have to submit online. Okay, so every month between one to ten. That is first day of every month to 10th day of every month you can apply here so before applying please download this guidelines to see what all there what they have mentioned okay and also you can apply here you can click here and apply before understanding about the guidelines let us see how you can apply so once if you click here anyhow they'll be asking you to read the inst guidelines okay and instructions will be there to fill the form so it will be downloaded downloaded in the uh, in the pdf format you can click there i'll also show you that format here you can see apply online okay because since today is 18th of january so you cannot submit uh, you cannot see this here okay so let us see what is the guideline and what is the uh, application that is what is the instructions you have to read before some before uh, um, submitting or preparing for this internship here you can see the complete guidelines um, so you can see like what uh, when the guidelines they have uh, they have launched this scheme okay uh, the internship will be unpaid basis then what is the purpose see you if you complete this internship you will be getting the certificate from the government of india okay so don't worry about it uh, the scheme what is the name of the scheme what is the purpose of the scheme you can see here okay what is the objective of the scheme okay internships shall be available throughout the year so as i said you can apply for the internship between 1 to 10 day between 1 to 10 of every month okay who are all eligible okay so bona fide students of any recognized university institution within india or abroad fulfilling following conditions so what you should fulfill you should be an undergraduate student having completed appeared in the term and exam of second year that is a fourth semester of the bachelor degree course and secured not less than 85 percentage or equivalent marks in the 12th class okay graduate students having completed appeared in the term and exams of the first year of your postgraduate program <clears throat> 
और परस्यूइंग परस्यूइंग रिसर्च पी एच डी एंड सिक्योर्ड नॉट लेस देन सेवेंटी परसेंटेज और इक्वल एंड मार्क इन द ग्रेजुएशन द स्टूडेंट्स हु हैव अपियर्ड इन द फाइनल एग्जाम और जस्ट कंप्लीटेड ग्रेजुएशन और अवेटिंग फॉर द हायर स्टडीज में ऑल्सो भी कंसिडर्ड ओके सो दिस इज वट एंड वट इज हाउ मेनी वीक्स और मंथ्स यू विल बी डूइंग दिस इंटर्नशिप सो इट विल बी एटलीस्ट सिक्स वीक्स एंड इट विल नॉट एक्सीड सिक्स मंथ्स ओके इंटर्न्स नॉट कंप्लीटिंग द रिक्वेस्टेड पीरियड विल नॉट बी इश्यूड एनी सर्टिफिकेट ओके अ सर्टिफिकेट रिगार्डिंग सक्सेसफुल कंप्लीशन ऑफ द इंटर्नशिप शैल बी इश्यूड बाय द एडवाइजर ऑफ द कंसर्न सब्जेक्ट डिविशन इन द एनक्लोज फॉर्मेट सो यू कैन जस्ट स्क्रॉल डाउन एंड सी द एनेक्शर बी you will be getting a uh, you will be getting a letter head of uh, government okay government letter head you will be getting this complete <coughs> certificate from them okay and um, yeah logistic and support interns will be required to have their own laptops niti ayog shall provide them working space internet facility and other necessity as demand deem the fit by the concerned heads okay so these they'll be providing and how, what are the procedures to apply so here you can see we you have to apply online okay so this is they this is because since they have issued this guidelines on 18 so they have mentioned like that okay but it has changed that from every month between 1 to 10 you can apply okay you have to indicate the area of interest uh, what is the internship duration like what is the during financial year uh so a candidate can apply for internship only once during a financial year so you can apply once you cannot apply multiple times okay so other modalities you can just read this completely and uh, attendance your attendance should be like this so what are the domains which are uh, which are eligible for this internship you can see agriculture data management analysis economics education in ag sector of course it covers uh, most of the um most of the domains and fields right so and then you can see an extra b like what is a format an extra c format for noc uh that is no objection certificate to be obtained from the college or the institution so you cannot apply independently okay by yourself you have to get the noc from your university or the college wherever you are working and then you have to apply for this okay and the general information of to fill online application form name so you have to enter the name as in your certificate like class 10 or higher school certificate father name address contact number mobile number email id date of birth education qualification and select the qualification stated if you are pursuing or if you have completed so you can enter the mark percentage you can see how you have to enter what is the area of interest interest so this is what the important note which you should definitely see you are eligible to apply for the internship only if you fulfill the eligibility criteria mentioned in the guidelines so internship application will be accepted online during first to 10th of every month no other mode of application will be accepted so you have to accept online you are advised to check the details before submission no correspondence regarding the change of the details will be entertained so don't change it. don't wish to change anything be sure before for you apply you should note registration number after submitting the application form for the future reference so uh, with that registration number only you can uh, track whether your internship is accepted or not okay niti ayog does not assume a, a, any responsibility if you are not being able to submit your application on account of technical reasons or any other reasons beyond the control of niti ayog you need to send the print send the print out of online application or any other supporting sorry you need not send a print out so you don't like you know previously in some um government exams and all we have to send the application and everything through uh, through uh, postal okay through post so they are specifically mentioning that you need not send the print out in case of any web related issues you can contact to this mail id so it is clearly mentioned so if you are um uh, if you wanted to apply so i request you to apply at least before a month okay they will be screening it so of course you will be knowing like which semester you need an internship okay or probably it will be good no if you are planning to uh, if you are planning to apply for any internship 
uh, you can you can consider this first and apply because you are getting uh, you are uh, trained by the government officials and also you will be getting um, a good accreditation after this so don't wait you can apply this so if you uh, if you really feel that this information is very useful please share it with your friends please share it with your uh, uh, students if even if you are a professional who are seeing this video you can share it with your with someone who is really working sorry really uh, doing their uh, uh, doing their undergraduate or postgraduate it will be definitely useful for them okay thank you take care bye bye